Hey guys, so today is the, um, the 6th of September, 2024, and I'm just outside Spring Garden Park. This will be my thumbnail. So, yeah, as you can see, this park has no playgrounds, no benches, nothing. It's pretty much like Thistletown Park, except much smaller. And over there, you can see Bloor Islington Place. And I just felt a raindrop, so... I just hope I don't get rained on it. And if I do, I can always get on the bus and go home. Although I have no idea how often the buses come these days. And if you can excuse me, I... I feel like I'm catching the hiccups. So, you got a mini forest here, which kind of leads to private property, so we're not going to go there. But let's check out this path. This path. It's going to be a short but sweet walking video because the, pa the path only goes towards Meadowvale Road. <laughs> so, and it's really not far from here. So th this is basically Mimico Creek. That's where the chip chipmunks live. Sorry guys, those hiccups are quite ridiculous. Thank goodness it's not going to be a very long video. Now this this tree kind of looks like a monster. Like it's it's so ancient. The bark has an ancient vibe. But you see those two look like eyes. And they can be misrepresented. You know, that's how children are often feared have fear of the dark because they see things that look in the dark that look like monsters but when you turn the light on it turns out there really aren't any <laughs> but I can see where this is headed because they those deceptive images can be pretty scary so should I go There's various paths I want to take. Now, the private property is fenced out, so... I don't think it'll hurt if I just walk right by. Nice. Looks like somebody has a treehouse in their yard. I'm not going to point the camera to... I'm not going to point the camera to it. I'll just mention it. Okay, this path leads to private property private property, so we're going to get out of here. Like, there's no fencing. Mm. So, why take risks? <laughs> they did say um, chance of a thunder mm. thunderstorm today. So maybe I shouldn't be out here for too long. Though I am a little protected by rain. If I'm if I'm under tree canopy, only only thing is though the the rain pours off drips off of the leaves. So being in the forest can give you some some slight shelter from rain. Now this path leads straight down to the creek. And it's going to go all the way into Lake Ontario. The Humber River, the creek, it all ends up in Lake Ontario.
Was that an animal I just saw? I hope not. It's probably the the leaves. Oh, there's a there's a chip chipmunk hole right in the ground. Back in 2016, I used to pour water down the hole, the chipmunk's hole, and after I told my mom about it, she got really mad at me. Now, when I did pour the water, it's because when I poured water, the chipmunk came out of its hole. And then I, I was being observant, and I told my mom about it, and then she got angry with me. Yeah, I mean, technically you shouldn't do that because it dis it dis uh, disturbs their wildlife. Got a mound of dirt here. <laughs> for and by the way, for anyone who's wondering, um my first week of college <laughs> has been pretty good. I just have to wait two weeks until, until I fi find whether I will sink or swim. That's what I've been told, what my father told me. You know, after two weeks of college, you'll find out, am I gonna sink am, or or am I gonna swim? Hopefully I, it'll be swim and not sink. But I do have to wait two weeks until after I'm settled into my second semester. Somebody, somebody left a goalie net there. Oh, God. Well, thank goodness I'm about to end off the video. Nice looking house there. Ooh, look at that squirrel. And he's running away. Oh, I see another one. I see two running after each other. Yep, that looks like some sort of, some sort of a squirrel war. Come on, guys. Say cheese. Say cheese. All right, so you know what to do if you enjoy this video, and psst, I hope I hope you can stay tuned for more. Sorry, that's I'm really hiccuping a lot. I got to get rid of them. But hey, take care, take care, guys. Bye bye. <laughs>